It's a bizarre and complicated case that had its latest stop inside this Concord courtroom. The daughters of murdered real estate developer John Chakalos are trying to keep his grandson, Nathan Carmen, the man they think is responsible for his death, from getting a piece of his estate and are pursuing what's called a slayer action to do that. In this case, it's uh, brought alleging that Nathan Carmen killed his grandfather with the intent of profiting by it, of inheriting a substantial amount of money from the grandfather. And Chakalos was shot to death in his Connecticut home in 2013. There have been no charges filed in that case, and while his daughters blame Carmen, he maintains his innocence. Last year, Linda Carmen, Nathan's mother, mysteriously disappeared at sea while fishing with her son, putting Nathan in line to inherit millions. That's something Chakalos' daughters oppose. Carmen's lawyers want this case dismissed, claiming Chakalos was not a New Hampshire resident. That just because uh, the will was filed in New Hampshire and uh, the death certificate was corrected to say New Hampshire as being a residency, that those documents in and of themselves don't necessarily mean he was a resident here. But both sides agreed they need months to flesh out that issue and agreed to come back to court again sometime in May. In Concord, Andy Hirschberger, WMUR News 9.